Alright, here's my 55 that I just did a water change on. Um, there's been a lot of fish taken out, set up, experiment, and then I took a few back here and there, transferred some to my other tank, I'll show you. But this is the 55 right now. I just uh, set these rocks up. I left a little more open sand. Um, I just took my, I want to say, four, four and a half inch uh, exasperatus out of here. He was a male. He was the only one trying to compete with the Chipotle. Right there, up in the middle. And, uh, Pretty much, this is just his territory. He don't really mess with that peacock. The peacock's the male too. He, he don't really chase it around. So it's okay right now. Um, so that's the dominant male right there. The male Chipoke. Pretty nice color. Um, I got a lot of sunlight in my house right now, so you really can't see the color. And uh, I know that yellow lab is a female. Um, she was holding, and I made a, what do they call it, an egg tumbler. And a uh, freak accident, there's too much uh, airflow when I was at work. And uh, ended up smushing the eggs on the top of the net. And uh, I'm not using that anymore. Next time one of them's holding, I'm just going to order the egg uh, tumbler and do it how it should be. Um, okay, so that's a female lab. Um, someone said that that's a female uh, OB that I got at uh, Petco, I think for uh, $9. Really cool color, not sure the actual species. I know it's definitely an Mbuna has a little bit of blue in it. It has really, really tiny bottom fins. Like super tiny. You see how small they are? He's real good looking. So he'll look cool when he's all grown out. And uh, in here I have two um, electric yellows. Not sure. If they're male or female, I know I just took a female out of this tank and put it in the 29. I'll show it later. Here's uh, one of my Mbuna just swimming around. I have uh, three, three Kenny's, the blue ones. I'm uh, pretty sure they're female because the Kenny blue are the female and the yellow ones are the males. Just they're happy about their water change. Um, this one's my favorite. He's real colorful. Uh, come on, buddy. You say I still think it's speeding time. Here's my other, just the two uh, electric yellows right there. Not sure whether it's male or female. I haven't vented them. The one I took out today, I did vent. Not sure, but they're bottom fins. Just looking at them. So there's the one. Uh, there's the other one. Pretty nice color. And uh, there's my uh, sunshine. Peacock. I got that for 10 bucks, I believe, at this one fish store that sells bigger Africans for like 15. I bought a few. He said he'd give it to me for 10 or 12 bucks. So, real good looking fish. I mean, I wish he had a little bit more blue, but I guess as he gets older, he might get a little more bluer. Um, yeah, here's some granite rocks. I picked up on the side of the road. So I found these granite rocks on the side of the highway. They have like a million big boulders of it. Cleaned it all up. Okay, we'll come in a minute. Um, I had some used heaters from uh, my old setups. 
And uh, I ordered these off of eBay. This is a 300 watt. I think I got it for like seven bucks. And I ordered a 200 watt for uh, my 29 tall that I got upstairs in my daughter's room. I got this canister filter. This is, uh, I think these are the Sun Sun knockoffs. And uh, I got that for like 48 bucks. So it says it puts out 265 gallons per hour, but I highly doubt it. Um, 